Good morning, David. Good morning, Karat. When and why should we use quantitative risk analysis? Quantitative risk analysis is usually viewed as optional because it requires specialist expertise, it requires specialist tools, uh, it requires time and effort to gather data and to analyze the data That's and right. to interpret the results. Yes. So there's clearly extra effort and expense involved in performing quantitative risk analysis. So we don't use it all the time. So then this question arises, when do we use it? Yeah. If we're doing projects, then large projects or complex projects or projects that are strategically important should be analyzed, their risk exposure should be analyzed in more detail than projects which are simple, which are small or which are strategically not so important. So the size or the importance of the project will guide us as to whether we need to have another level of analysis and use some of these quantitative tools. Um, strategic importance is, imp is, is significant as well outside of projects. There are other things which are of strategic importance. Um, so for example, strategy setting or strategy planning for an organization um, might need to have some kind of quantitative uh, element to the yeah. risk analysis. Yeah. The key is, if we're thinking about uncertainty that matters, if it has a potentially very big impact, either on a project or on uh, a, an organization, then we should think about using some of these more powerful techniques to get a, a better insight uh, into the risk exposure. The other thing to think about is if the, res if the um, variability or the, the variables that we're looking at can be quantified, yeah. sometimes we have situations where we can't quantify it. Yeah. So we're talking about reputation, for example. How yes. do you quantify yes. reputation risk? It's not so easy and so it's hard to do a quantitative analysis. Um, so quantitative analysis is very powerful. Yeah. It does require that extra effort and ex extra expertise and specialist tools. But in certain circumstances where there's high complexity, high potential impact, or high strategic importance, then I think it's worth investigating and using. And we should have access to skilled resources who are able to perform some of these specialized techniques. I definitely agree, because uh, quantitative uh, risk analysis has to do with a lot of complex uh, situations. I can give an example. Uh, in an evolving market, mm. you, need, you need certain models like market risk, value at risk, yes. you know, the MVAR or, or in operational risk, OPVAR yes. or, or you know, basically the value at risk in a very complex situation, uh, as you've rightly put it, uh, and an evolving market. That's where, uh, you know, is, an, is a good example exactly. where quantitative uh, quants do their job. And yes, uh, yes thank you very it's much. It's not for, for everyone. It's not for every situation. It's not for everyone, it I agree. it's very yes. powerful. Yes, yes. Thank you very much, David. Thank you.